Students at Claremont McKenna College say the controversy over these Halloween costumes is yet another example of racism on campus and how the university continues to turn a blind eye. Welcome back to CBS 2 News at 5. I'm Paul Majors. And I'm Pat Harvey. A costume controversy at Claremont McKenna College has now led to the resignation of the school's dean of students. The photo was the last straw in an ongoing debate over what some call a lack of inclusion on campus. Only on CBS 2, Christine Lazar spoke with the student who brought the photo to light. I was just hurt. It was this photo from Halloween that prompted Claremont McKenna student Casey Garcelon to take to social media to spotlight what she calls the marginalization of students of color at this private school. What's wrong with that photo is that they're appropriating culture and they're not, they're not being aware of it. Um, and I think that's a larger issue at the Claremont Colleges is people aren't aware of how they make students of color feel. In the photo, which Garcelon posted to her own Facebook page, two students are dressed as mariachis, complete with ponchos, sombreros, and maracas. Garcelon wasn't the only student to be offended. I'm just constantly confused by the fact that some people just don't get it and still make the same mistakes. You see this every year. I'm just kind of tired because, especially with access on the internet, I feel like like the knowledge is there. On campus today, students from all five Claremont colleges staged a rally to highlight a lack of support, they say, the administration has shown to students of color. Just hours earlier, the dean of students, Mary Spellman, resigned from her position after there were calls for her to do so, and two students went on a hunger strike. I think the students have heard a lot of empty apologies. Um, and we're tired of it. One of the women posing with the students dressed as mariachis in the Halloween photo has also resigned from her position as junior student body president. In a resignation email to the entire student body, she apologized for not speaking out against those costumes on Halloween, and she said to all of her defenders to stop blaming discrimination on ignorance. And the college did send out an email to the student body prior to Halloween, urging them to avoid any costumes that demean a culture. A photo of young people in sombreros was actually included in that email. Garcelon says the women in the photo have apologized to her and have asked her to take the photo photo off her Facebook page, but she refuses to do so. This is representative of a bigger issue, and that's why I posted it. That's why I shared it. The president of Claremont McKenna has responded, promising to create two new leadership positions on campus to promote diversity and inclusion. In Claremont, I'm Christine Lazar, CBS 2 News.